A local man is getting back to his career after the pandemic forced him to take more than a year off. Finally, the cruise ship worker is safely back at sea. Local 12's Alexa Helwig tells us what he did during his time off and what the comeback of his industry looks like. Brian Bailey turned a passion for entertaining people into a career. He works on cruise ships for a living. But last April, it all came to a screeching halt. Pandemic-related closures left him stranded at sea for 45 days. It was a very trying time because we didn't know where we could get off to go home. Bailey finally made it home to Ohio and stayed with his family in West Union. Then the cruise industry completely shut down. Having that stripped away for the last uh, 16 months, you know, it has been difficult. Bailey took on odd jobs around his hometown. He taught history at West Union Junior High, was a zookeeper at Family Traditions Animal Adventure. And also I uh, ended up working for a radio station. <laughs> so I, 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 I didn't expect to do all that. Triple A says travel this summer was very busy. Coming off a year of COVID restrictions, people were ready to go somewhere, anywhere. And the cruise industry is in comeback mode. 16 months later, Bailey finally got the call he'd waited for. Saying, hey, uh, we want you to come and be the cruise director for this ship. And I said, I'm in. Whatever it is, I, I'm, I'm coming. Bailey's now in a 14-day quarantine on a ship in Greece. The Silver Sea requires all staff and guests to be vaccinated. AAA is telling passengers to be prepared for quick changes because cruise line mandates can vary. What it is today may not be what it is a week from now. So you really have to stay on top of uh, what the current recommendations are when it comes to cruises. Bailey is excited to be back at sea, but worries about a recent surge in COVID cases. There is a thought of that throughout of the, of the Delta variant that I'm gonna somehow uh, either be sent home you know, too early, uh, or that I'll be stuck here. But he feels more prepared around this time as strict COVID protocols are in place on the ship. Alexa Helwig, Local 12 News. The CDC released new guidance for cruise ship travelers yesterday. It recommends people who are at increased risk for severe illness avoid cruises no matter their vaccine status.